This Wednesday, Chancellor Carol Folt held a town hall for faculty, students, and staff at the Genome Sciences Building to discuss the aftermath of former federal prosecutor Kenneth Weinstein's report of UNC's past academic irregularities. UNC student body president Andrew Powell is content with the findings of the report. It's going to take some time to heal as a university, but I think the answers that we were seeking we've gotten and uh, we can now implement any remaining changes that need to happen. Kenneth Weinstein's 136 page report said that some people in the athletics department relied on former administrative assistant Deborah Crowder and former department chairman Julius Niangoro to give easy classes to support struggling athletes who wouldn't have been eligible to play otherwise. African American and diaspora studies major Taylor Weber's Fields does have one complaint about the focus of the report. I think it kind of speaks to the racial undertones of the politics of the school and um, so for them to like zone in on this school I think it's just convenient to highlight that department when it is an institutional um, problem. Student body vice president Kyle Villamain wants the student body to get more into the conversation. Now is a time that we want a lot of student voices to come up and fill the conversation on campus about what this means for the student experience at Carolina. Folt said that the best solution to the situation is light, and many Tar Heels hope that the truth will allow UNC to move on. In Chapel Hill, I'm Marquise Emerson reporting.